Hey guys, it's Rox here, and I know it's been a minute, but I'm back now. And today I'll be giving y'all a showcase on the new unit in Anime Adventures, Danny, or as y'all know from Seven Deadly, Seven Deadly Sins, Diane. <laughs> Alright guys, so like I said in the intro, this will be a showcase on Diane. That's not the only character that's not the only unit we'll be doing a showcase on, due to the fact that I would like to try to make this into a mini series on all the seven daily sins units that have been brought into the game. Such as Meliodas, Diane, Kit King, and Julius. Or those are the only people that I've seen from the update eleven, which also includes new a brand new world fabled kingdom for the story brand new unique units which is what i just said and new stat poten new stat potential and you can talk to beard to reveal your units hidden stat potential and you got all this other stuff right here that's uh that i'm not reading all right now i'm not gonna lie but um yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you haven't already and if you want to see more content by me because like i said i'm back now yeah i know what that means i'm back on that grind but yes, without further ado, let's get right into this video. Guys, so we just hit wave three, so I had enough to get Diane because she cost 1.4k for some odd reason. Um, but that's that's that, that doesn't matter right now. So basically, we're gonna place a Diane right here because we need early access. And after we place a Diane, I'm gonna place a Meadow Knight because I know she's not trying to do it by herself. Due to me being like on the third to last, second to last story. So we're gonna use Metal Knight as some backup, but I'll still be, this is still a Diane showcase, so she will be upgraded more than Metal Knight, most likely. Just depends on how the game goes. Then we might place a little Yuta right here, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, we're gonna place a Yuta right here. And so now we're going to, first we need to upgrade Boma, but, so, here, her beginner stats for um, upgrade zero with no upgrades, she does 1.5k. And by the way, she's uh, level 83 for me right now. So she does 1.5k damage every eight seconds. She attacks and yeah, I have her at attack first. And she's also a ground, ground unit, so she can't attack in the sky. So you gotta be very mindful about that. Extremely mindful about that. And uh, yeah, so we're about to upgrade her again because like she can take it. So with two upgrades, she does 6k damage with 7.5k cooldown. 7, 7.5 second cooldown, 5k. It's crazy. Um, I'm gonna get back to y'all when uh, in the when in the better ways when she's uh more more beefy and more buff. Alright, so guys, we're at wave 12, and currently I have Diana upgrade 4. She does, she's doing 18k per hit every 10 seconds. And we also have Metal Knight upgraded a lot, and we have Yuta, Yuta oh, upgraded a lot. He, they, I needed it, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I needed, the, I needed the buff. Come on, Metal Knight. Kill him right now. Come on, kill him right now. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That'd be Metal Knight, that'd be. So, um, next person playing upgrade is Yuta, because I'm not gonna lie. I need, I need beefiness at the start, bro. Like, beefiness. Big beef. Big boss. Big buffs. Yep, so I need that. Mm hmm. It's over. It's over. Now we got to upgrade big. I'm like, oh, I call her big mom. All right, so now we got her upgrade five. We got him upgrade four. So yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. She got a new move. It's called some rock slam or something like that. It is 25k damage every 10 seconds or 10.1 seconds, which is pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty big and beefy. Very beefy. And um. So yeah, I'm gonna get back at y'all when it's a wave, when it's a wave like 14, mid 14 or mid 15, cause like that's when it really gets, you know, saying action packed, you know what I'm saying? All right, guys. So um, we just hit wave four, 15 actually. Wow, that's actually crazy. And um, so we have her upgraded five, upgraded to five, and we got um my boy Benodite up to uh, about seven, cause we need that. I'm not gonna lie. And we got my boy Yuta his cursed speech, his cursed speech, and um, she's still doing the same, cause like she's not. She's, I need her to be, I need her to beef them up like right here. They need to get beefed up right here. Yep, yep, and that curse speech is reaching. Yes, sir. I think curse speech slows as well, which is why Yuto is such a good, you know what I'm saying, person for me to have. And he also takes, he also breaking shields by itself almost. So, yes, we will be 
think this is a, is a success. This is a take three, by the way. I'm not gonna lie, because I died, like, I died on wave 15, bro, because I like, bro. Yeah, I don't even want to talk about it. I just know that we are smacking him around right now. Currently, he's getting beaten up. He's getting plumbered, to, plumbered into the ground. We're gonna summon Nami on him, because we don't even care. We're gonna despawn Yuta, and we're gonna get ourselves another Diane to finish off the job. Finish him. Finish him, Diane. Finish him. Oh, no, she might not be able to do it either. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on, we're gonna sell this Diane, because she's not doing no justice. Um, And we're gonna get it. We're gonna get ourselves another another Metal Knight, you know what I'm saying? Because he don't want no smoke on Metal Knight, you know what I'm saying? He don't want no static with my boy Metal Knight. Put the mink on him. Hey. We're gonna give Diane the final blow, though. I'm not gonna lie. Yep, sell him. Yep. Yeah, Diane, finish him. Finish him. He. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's too easy. All right, guys. So I think that's 100% gonna conclude this video. That was the showcase on Diane or Danny from from Seven Deadly Sins. And um yeah, I'll I, I could say I'll give her about like a, a good a good seven or eight out of ten. She does a lot of damage. Though I only had one of her spawn, which was probably pretty dumb, but like I'm pretty sure in infinite or something she'll be very good. Cause like she does a lot of damage early too. Early and often, my boys, early and often. But yeah, with the help of Metal Knight and Yuta, we actually got a lot accomplished and like at the end we had to really strategize by selling and then placing her down and stuff like that but um yeah i recommend you get her though because uh she's pretty good she's like super super good especially if you're like beginning beginner you know what i'm saying you have a money unit like boma or speed wagon but yeah uh um that's 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 somebody i will keep so like if y'all see another video where she's on the slot just know she's still being used at the at the time but um yeah i feel like her cooldown should be reduced but i mean she does a lot of damage so i can see why they wouldn't be but like i feel like she's had metal knight type cooldowns or wait, she might have Metal Knight type cooldown. Let me, let me let's go ahead and take a look. No, yes, yeah, Metal Knight is a second off, and he does way more. You know what I'm saying? But um, yes. Um, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on notifications. Turn on post notifications so you get notified every time I post a video or a live stream. Cause as like I said in the beginning, I'm back. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say it, but you know what I'm saying. I'm back. It's a parade inside my city, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yes, okay, so I'll catch you guys in the next one. There's no telling what person what person I'm gonna do next. It just depends on who I get who I get, I'm not gonna lie. So uh, yeah, peace.